and welcome back YouTube people anybody watching on there we just did some some upgrading we upgraded the chest we upgraded the waist a little bit uh yep and we put the amulet of Kavos here on for slowing down time and upgraded that a little bit and we upgraded one handle that we will switch out for the boss that gives more strength on executioner cleaves because we use a lot of them for that this way yeah other than that we are ready to head in we'll take it at and move on hey how did sindri get ahead of us he and the blue one do seem to travel quickly this area coming up right here we're inside it's a bit finicky so of course you want to try to get the boy up in the sky you want him dead or he will keep spawning more and more of these boys Yeah, any time anytime you see the, the one with the double-sided dumbbells, kill them first. 100 percent Long as they stay alive, they will keep respawning more, more and more dark elves. Which is never fun. Alright. We got some hacky silver back here. Got this chest here, but to open it up, you need to hit all three of these, which you gotta hit from this angle down here. Right there. And more materials. All right, this area has a bunch of nightmares. Try to work on them separately, if at all possible. Because of that. here before the dark elves destroyed everything okay or hacky hacky silver up here dun, dun, dun. it's probably one of my least favorite areas because of enemies but kind of one of the favorite areas to look at just because it's got a breeze going through here I think if you ever noticed not not much of the rest of the place has any movement it's just stagnant but here, there's like a solid breeze that just blows through here. I don't know why I like that. Whoa! Now that's impressive. That is impressive. Also, that's what. Never mind. Can you lure? From darkness, keep safe the light. Didn't do a very good job, did they? They didn't. Well, they're trying to keep the other elves from getting it. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay, got a hex over up here. Now, my my question is, maybe somebody in chat has thoughts on this. 
Who's the real bad side? The light or the dark? Is there a bad side? And are they really that different? Okay. Should be health inside here. If you need it. And then we got a chest over here. This is for the other arcane wraps. There's a couple you gotta throw through here, so... Gotta be a little bit... A little bit straight with it. And we hop back over. And that unlocks the chest over here. And this, I believe, is the arcane waste. Or the runic waste, I should say. There you go. Runic war belt. Very good for runic builds. That's the way you're going. That's a good one for you. And up we go. Zoop doop doo doop doop doop. Zoop doop doo doop. There, the light. They've covered it up with that stuff. How would they do that? Look, another light up. What's he doing? Oh no! Why are they killing him? He didn't do anything. He's getting stabbed. That's what he's doing. You are seeing the end of a war, boy. You do not know what led to okay. this moment. But he didn't there is another spawny boy. Was his choice. Right over on the other Ours. side. So, get to him as fast as possible. Is near. Look for a way inside. Dun, 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 dun. All right. X over up top. Open this boy up. Follow me. All right, and we go over. Now we got a whole bunch of these bad boys down here. Just take your time with these fellas. Because there's going to be more that spawn up here. Again, make sure to kill that guy very quickly. Ow. 
Ah, what? What? That was being weird. He must have bounced off that log or something. So strange. I thought he'd fallen off. Yeah, that's it for here. More hacks over. There's always hacks over up top. And always. And you'll know it because you can hear the nice squishy squishy sounds. Listen for the squishy squishies. You're restoring all the pathway. <laughs> Okay. Up here, we got all the triple throws here. This is just a sequence of three throws. First three are this way. One, two, three. One, two, three. Then you move to the end. Basically, just do that one first, then move to the end of each one. And to the end. Turn. And three. Now we get to see all the weird, creepy faces. You pay attention when we're squeezing through this wall over here. Look at the right side of the screen while I'm squeezing through. I don't think we're supposed to be in here. Quiet. He just palms their face. It's fine, boy. It's fine. And here we are. In the that? uterus of Alfheim. Stay alert and by my side. Hey, when we make it to the light, how do you think we get it into the Bifrost? The witch said to step into it. She did? When she was ripped away from this world. Naturally, you just stick it in. How did I miss that? You are more concerned with her safety than our goal. <laughs> Quiet. I have it. Your knife boy. Splat. That was close. Right. Do not stray from me, boy. You don't gotta tell me. Here comes. That's what she said. Tunnel. Oh, it's so sticky. See what I mean? Gina Nuna. Another Gina one. Nuna. Stay back. This part coming up can be a pain. It is a good idea to have rage at this yeah. point. When it falls, be ready. We will need to move quickly. I do not. But if you happen to have the uh, talisman of eternal freak, like fury, that's why it's very good in this area. Fill up your rage because this next area, it's not about killing; it's about moving very, very quickly. So just remember that part. Don't have to kill stuff. Just got to get past it. Here they come. Stay behind me and protect our flank. Yeah, if you have rage, you can pop rage at any point. And just run. Keep shooting, boy. I will clear our path. Shorten the time between your volleys. 
There are many targets. You will not miss. A narrow path negates superior numbers. Stay focused. Are you injured? I'm fine. Wow. It's beautiful. I like the little axe twirly does there. The nonchalant. Got to get it right in the right in the, the good the good spot in the grip. The whole temple reappear. It's the source of all of it. Hey that boy, he's so smart. She's in there. Good job, boy. It'd have been so good if Kratos just let out a little giggle right there. Just a tiny giggle. Also, my point being proven right here, when I say one of the things that they really need to add in the next game is boots. Look at them things. Makes him look like he's got little chicken legs all wrapped up in leather. Like somebody just ordered takeout at Yaya's. We're like, hey, can I get uh, two chicken legs wrapped in I'm bacon? You hold my axe. It is not a gift. Uh -huh. Give the man some damn boots. to come back you left me here alone atreus alone with him he always leaves he's never here he doesn't want me and he never will seem to want to. I'm strong. I'm smart. I'm not what he thinks I am. I know better. He doesn't talk to me. Doesn't teach me. It should have been him. Do you hear me? Him, not you. Except... I don't know. I love him. I just wish he was better. I know he can be. So if he tries, I'll try. But if he doesn't, please come back. I know you're out there somewhere. Poor boy. He's got a head full of shit going on there.
boy. I was God only. Moments. No! You've been gone a long, <coughs> long time. I didn't know what to do. You left me here again. <coughs> Why don't you care? I... That's impossible. We should go before they come back. I hope you got what you needed. <laughs> Boy went to murder town. Yes. Look, there's our exit. But there's okay. no light to make a bridge. We're trapped. And the witch's bowstring is useless. Boy, your bow. Time for the light. Hold it out. On my mark, loose your arrow into the stone. It worked. We can now make our way back. Come. And off we go. That stairway's blocked. There's a white crystal ahead. Just laying there. Okay. Maybe it'll help us get out. First things first, we all grab the light crystal. We bring it over here. So we can go get said chest up top. Six percent less damage. That's big. Big, big, big. And then we're gonna bring old boy over here. Put him in this one. Make that bridge. Also gonna shoot that one. Make that bridge same time. And head across. There's nothing else over here. We're gonna have some nightmares on the other side of here. Three in total. wrong on that one here three over there all right got a chest back here get throw straight through force more hex over and hit this right now if you want that's gonna be our way back up to the top but we got to get over to light that crystal So we gotta light this crystal. Well, thought I was far enough away from that. And down it goes. And we can look over here. And hit these. Finally. I'll light the crystal if you find me an angle. <sighs> Let us Boop. make our way back up. Da ding And back up we go. There will be two guys up here. And then over there. Be another one. Again. 
Get rid of that guy. Beautiful. And we're going to go over here. Some decent. Need to knock this guy down. You can do it afterwards. If you're trying to get through here fast, you can actually knock this down now. Run straight over and grab it. Just run up the stairs. But we are grabbing stuff here. So we're not going to do that yet. We'll fight the guys over here. chest we have another runic attack Choying strike of the utgar it's kind of like the atzi's talon but uh, horizontal instead of vertical basically sends out a big wave right there the more you upgrade it the more waves pretty nice pretty pretty nice yeah, it's actually a pretty good light runic attack for like crowd control not bad has a little bit of a charge up time but it does do quite a bit of frost damage when it's upgraded so that's where you'll get it You're right can, can you can you pick up the crystal please thank you, where are you taking that? and we get lore first Boy. Boa. Okay. Where did we get there? From the light we are born and light we return. The light is the river of souls, transforming us, consuming us, transcending life and death. The light is the truth. The light is all. Okay, light sounds great, but maybe it also makes you crazy. Seems to make sense. Seems to make plenty of sense. All right, let's take this crystal back up and bring it up here. You gonna carry that everywhere? I just might. Yeah, we'll show you a little little trick over here. Normally, what you're supposed to do. Which we're gonna do because there is a chest up there. Stick this in here like this, climb up here, and then throw with these vines here. But you back up right about where these two little flowers are and use an R2 throw right about the bottom edge there. You can get to cut all those without having to climb up. It's a little skeep, but we are getting everything, so we're going to go up here, because there's a chest up here. Another nowhere near chest. Dun, dun, dun. And I believe some hacks over over here. Yep. I can see one of the bells there. One straight over top of it. The other one's over here. So this is kind of the area you want to be. You can see them there. 
there then you got one right over here I usually throw from this angle there you be if I want your opinion boy I will ask for it there's an X-horn yeah like I said this is where you would normally go to throw for those vines is right there That in there. Light her up. Reach the bowl now. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And we throw a boy up here. What does this mean? Seed. Remember the shape. Yeah, I know. It's a fox. Go ahead. Greatest man nor tallest tree begins as any more than me. Yeah, it's seed. Stupid riddles. Stupid riddles. So, it's a door after all. <laughs> Whee! Light elves. The light elves. The light elves are back. Freed the light of Alfheim from whatever the dark elves were doing to it. They all return to the temple. Everything is beautiful on Alfheim now. That the light shines free. The light elves seem nice. They don't really say anything. But at least they aren't trying to kill us. So it's a fair point. Father says I shouldn't assume anything. But what does he know? He was doing who knows what inside the light. While I had to take down an entire swarm of dark elves by myself. I mean, he did a pretty good job. I don't care what he says. I'm glad we got involved. Oh, might eat those words. I hate that guy. In the next game, he will be back. That he will. I'm really, Maybe Leslie. I wish they let you walk up here. Do you see any other way? Up on no. top there. Then. Does those open up afterwards? Be cool to figure out where they go to. But you can't. All right, back down we go. Now we're gonna start remembering some of those things that we were talking about in the last episode. Cause there's stuff down here. Here we go. Artifact. Got a chest here. Whoop. And that should be it for down here. Now, out here, we have two revenants. One's going to spawn to the right, one is going to spawn to the left. There's light. We are going to try take this one to the right out very quickly.
Make sure you always grab the hack silver for them because they drop a lot of hack silver. Adapt. It is very good. And this one also dropped an enchantment. Noise. Wanna try using your eye? There's a room just over there. Boy. Listen, you little turd. Okay. Why? Why is it gotta be such a little buttle? Such a little buttle. Yeah. All right, so this is the second way to go. This way, though, we gotta go first. And in here, knock down this. Bunch of drugs are gonna spawn. And use this tunnel here to kind of block everybody off. Hacky hacky. Artifacty. Five out of six. Whip. And sure, then we need this fella. Don't want you to be lagging behind when we get attacked. Shut up, boy. And quiet. Alright, going back out here. We're gonna have one big old dragger. He's gonna spawn. Force you to put down the crystal. So you might as well, as soon as you hear him. Pick this back up. Okay, so we're going over here. Dun, dun. Get to him. Put this in here. Now this, when you light it, is going to Boop. pop up those letters, which you gotta find. I can hit him. It wasn't fast enough. It's actually two left, two left, one and one. If I can remember, 
Lucas Dos Santos. Jan Lucas Dos Santos. Thank you for the follow, my friend. Appreciate it. Welcome to the stream. Good to have you. And in here, we got our final piece to the runic set that we've been picking up as we're going around. Not the greatest looking, but if we're doing a runic build, very, very good start set. All right. That's everything over here. We have one more thing to grab on the way back. And we need the loot crystal again. Almost forgot about that. So we're going to head back over here. Brazil. A lot of God of War fans in Brazil. I know that. I do not speak Portuguese. But I'm glad you're here. Boy, yeah, right. Shoot. I know how it works. Because there, we light that up. It gives us the bridge back over to here. We need health. There is health in here. And then we got to go back down to here. If we remember this from earlier, this will all be open down here now. Do, 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 do. Yeah, da, 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 da. And we get our last artifact. There's the set for the area. I don't think there was anything else in these. Pretty sure. Yep. Just some pots. And we are back out. Da -da -da. And off we go. All right. Here we come to the boss fight. I'm going to switch this out for the weighted war handle because we do a lot of cleaves. And if you know the timing for this guy, it makes it much, much better with the amulet of Kavos here. But if you don't, just parry. But if you're not great with it, I would actually suggest grabbing either Unbound, so you have the extra Runic Attacks, or Talisman of Protection to give you that extra defense or the bigger, bigger parry window. Either of those is good for it. But if you're really good with the timing, Amulet Kavos here is the way to go with this guy. That was a bad start.
almost forgot to get these. There we go. Let's wait for boy to get him. Because we probably did. The wrong side. I... Just killed the Dark Elf King. Has been harassing us this whole time. Thought I'd feel good about that. But just before he died, said the Light Elves were the bad guys. Uh-huh. Could that be true? We've been fighting against the good guys this whole time. The Light Elves don't seem evil. But... If they really were the ones who started this war, then maybe the Dark Elves... We're just fighting back. So confusing. I guess I see why father didn't want to get involved. But I'm not going to tell him that. Because I'm a little jackass. I just wanted to add that in there. Just because. Let me guess. You're going to be smug and say you told me we shouldn't get involved. That is enough. Can we go now? And we got our first runic summon for the boy. Yeah. Wrath of the Wolf. One of the best in the game. And you get it quite early. Super nice. Super nice. All right. I think that's it. These little side guys. They open up. There we go. So there's Hacksilver in there. We have all the artifacts. We have all the chests. And we're out. Do you remember the answer? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Kid's such a prick. Such a prick. Yeah, yeah. Boy, read this. Boy, what's that say? Guys can't see it, but you can hear it. That's me clicking R1. So it's like trying to punch that boy. The only time you care to talk I to me said. is you need me to translate for you. If mom was if here... If your mother was still alive, we would not be here at all. Okay. BM, Kratos. You know? Atreus. Forget it. Fine. All right. That be everything in Alfheim. So we should be able to look at it. The only thing that is not done in here. Oh, we do have the realm tear, which we can do. We will do that real fast before we leave. Could do this when you come back because you will have to come back to fight the Valkyries. They are on this side of the island. There's also a raven down inside there. If you are getting realm tears, you need the blue arrows for it. The light arrows. And you gotta light all these boys. 
Get yourself a ram tear. There's going to be some hatchet boys that come out of here. They're not nice. Good way to deal with them. Let's use unbound potential and spam runic attacks. Because they're fairly strong. There we go. And get yourself more dust. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's right. This one gives you the pure essence of realms as well. It's one of few. Yeah, as long as you have that done, if you look at your map, you should only have Two things undiscovered on the left side. One Odin's Raven, because it is down inside the chamber. One Valkyrie. And one Mystic Gateway, because that's all down inside the chamber. Everything there has to do with the chamber. So as long as you're good on everything else. This house is clear. And we can go. Back to row, row, row your... Never seen that... Like, block under the water right there. Probably a hundred playthroughs and... Never noticed that rock. That was weird. Not like you would even care if she was. Mind your tongue, boy! Sorry. Until our journey is over, one of us must remain focused. Do not mistake my silence for lack of grief. Mourn how you wish. Leave me to my own. I'm sorry. I didn't realize. No. Why would you? You do not know my ways. You're just a filthy boy. It's not been easy. In the light, I felt only moments pass. If that is of some comfort to you, that's good to know. Really? It's like, yeah, that's comforting. As so I was sitting there for a week, face the black breath, killing dark elves. Or do you think there's more to see in this realm? There's still more to see, boy, but not right now. Not right now. All right. You're back. I see you've been busy. You're back. Our observant. I am known for my attention to detail. You boys look like you're gearing up for quite the journey. Yes. There's an abandoned See what he's got to say here. Midgard yeah, there we go. Converted to his personal storeroom. Packed it with all sorts of treasures he collected during his travels throughout the realms. Throughout the realms? Which ones did he go to? What did he collect? Fafnir was a, shall we say, aggressive collector of magical artifacts. The more he acquired, the more he desired. There was no realm too dangerous, no relic too hazardous. He once ventured deep into Niflheim for a whetstone of all things. Huh. I bet that was quite the whetstone. Does this story have a point? Yes, it does. I just happen to have an entry stone to Fafnir's storeroom. You might find something useful in there. Neat. Thanks, Sindri. You're very welcome. Oh, and uh, if you find that whetstone, well, it sure would be nice of you to bring it to me. Ta-da! That's the start of the side favors. Caution if you're <coughs> heading to the storeroom. Last I was there, all manner of nastiness had taken up residence. Won't your friend be upset if we steal all the stuff? 
No, he's not. Sorry. No, he's not. Fafnir's not dead. He's a dragon. He's an evil dragon. I have a confession. I wouldn't say evil. That's what it's not evil. In my head. Well, this wasn't the first time. Back when we met Brock, his animal warned me about something hiding in the trees. That's why she didn't want to cross. She told you. Well, I could just feel what she was feeling. What she was afraid of. Hmm. It happens again. You tell me. Understand? I promise. Uh-huh. It'll happen again. Oh, yes. That it shall. Okay. Back to Midgard we go. What now? We have the light to Midgard. It's crazy to think that all the realms exist in the same space, one on top of the other. It's like this room lets us travel without moving. And we are back in Midgard. And since we're back in Midgard, if you're watching on YouTube, this is going to end this episode. But I'll see you on the next one. Twitch, don't go nowhere. <laughs>